So, this review is nothing new. You probably just seen it down there. Uh, fig figured out the oh, that I've done a review on this. So, Copenhagen Winter Dream. It's already been cracked, guys. Really sorry about that. There's like one, one dip left, and I only have one dip left in everything that I have. I think so. Pack this shit, but first. Oh, this is the camo can. This is not what the actual can looks like. I know that you've already seen this shit. I know every fucking dipper has. It's just a green can right there, and yeah. This is the camo cans. They actually look really nice this year. Okay. Pack it up. Crack that shit. Now that's my last dip. All that shit right there got to go into the dip. So basically take it and ring your fingers around it really quick. This is a lot easier to do on this camera. What the hell? Then you should be able to pinch it out. Dip it all out. <sighs> Make it a small tiny mess, but you're okay. That's how much you got in there, guys. Oh, oh man. Mm. Every time I do Winter Dream, I always get this fucking buzz from hell, dude. I used to be able to do this shit all the damn time. Only thing I used to do. Till I found straight and all that stuff. This has my name all over it. And it's yelling buzz. Well, did you will. Ooh. Gotta get the rest. Okay, my first thoughts on this shit. I've already had this before, so I'm going to do it on this can since it's a camo can, so yeah. My thoughts on Copenhagen Long Cut Winter Dream. The buzz, which I know will hit me soon, I will talk about that in a minute, and then I'm going to talk about the flavor and how much nicotine it tastes like and shit. My hair's all fucked up because I just took out. But, um, taste of it. It's an okay, like a really good okay, uh, Winter Dream. It's a really good dip. If you don't like this, I don't see how. Fucking Coke Junkies, come on, dude. This is, this is what's up, dude. But, once you get a buzz, you don't really enjoy it that much. Ah, shit. Yeah. Like, the more buzzes you get, it's harder to get one. Like, um. Cause like with Longhorn, if I took a small little pinch out of that and never first started, I get buzzed off my ass. You're like, oh shit. I'm not gonna do like a whole can. I used to be able to do a whole can of this shit without getting buzzed, and now I get buzzed like a bitch from it. So, yeah. But the flavor mixes in with the season. It is down here in Georgia, and probably everywhere already. Cause it's cold now, and um, it's fall, so. That does really good with um that shit. So yeah, these are the guaranteed fresh cans. Unlike the uh, mint can that I got, that was not guaranteed fresh. The date of this is March twelfth, twenty seventeen. I don't see how people like cannot read the damn face on the back of the can, like brr it. Literally right there. It's hard to see though, but see, March 12, 2017, Best Buy or Sell Buy. I got in a fucking. Can you stop wrapping up your damn shit, motherfucker? Y'all didn't hear that, but I did. Um, skull cans from fucking 2015 and already 2016. So that shit was like a year old, but it was alright still. Hell. What else? 
And this is a really good dip, though. I suggest going out there and try this shit. You can see that. And um, tell me what you th think of it or you thought about it down below. And um, yeah. Um, tell me anything in the comments. Like, how many fucking cans of this shit do you buy if you go to the damn gas station or your tobacco shop and get this? Um, what kind do you have now or some shit? I don't know. I like to talk to you guys in really the comments are the only way some of you I have your Facebook and shit. Like about two or three of you guys. You guys know my name. James Sorrow. Look me up on Facebook. Oh, uh, I have like several accounts but I just find every one of them and I'll get you the right one because I always forget my fucking password. But yeah. All that shit. Yeah. Ugh. We got, for the race yesterday, we got second in points for the season. We got fourth place last night. We had a really good third place uh, heat race in practice. And yeah, they had them damn trucks down there, and that shit was fucking awesome, dude. Them fucking big rigs. I have never seen a big rig drift in my entire life. And that was really fucking awesome to see. No fuckers coming out of them turns sideways, fucking dirt tracking. This one dude had uh, spun out, this uh, truck hit him, went all the way around the turn, and all the way down the fucking front stretch with the dude sideways fucking pushing him. Them guys don't fucking play. Um, but yeah, guys, we got second in points for the season. Fourth place last night, 80 fucking dollars. That's lit. Who I mean, the fuck says that? That's the lit, dude. Yeah, studied. I do. I say study. But fuck it. I don't know. Back to the fucking review. Um, if I buy a log of this, I will be giving these away to certain subscribers of mine. Um, ones that have commented just about on every one of my um videos so if you want to get one of these go comment on at least every one of my videos and i will find a can and send it to you because my dip power is okay i need to add more but hey why not give up something for you guys shit why not oh i'm fucking loving cans though dude these fucking camo cans are awesome because um my airsoft ship is BDU, and this will go fucking awesome on my damn helmet in the cat eye bands sitting right there. So that'd be fucking cool. Um, uh, hopefully this video pulls in a lot of fucking views and more subscribers. If you have not subscribed to this channel, please go in there, subscribe to me. You can like, dislike these videos. I really don't care. Like, I do care if you like them, but, um, if you dislike them, go down below and don't like Tell me what you did not like about these videos, what you do not like about me. I have ADHD, that's why I talk fast most of the time. Other times I'm really fucking hyper, like, this shit will get me fucking... Ugh. My dip tower set up right there, guys. Um, I'm about to start doing videos right there. So, um, the dip towers were, like, behind me and shit, so you can see that. And, uh, yeah, guys. Guess that's about it. Or go try this shit. The camo cans are getting awesome. Haven't got them yet. I hope you fucking do. Because the mint cam makes the mint taste so different. I just fucking love it. If you hate the Copenhagen mint, go get you a can or fucking get a pinch from somebody when your buddies are in the because has a whole different taste than them fucking shit cans that are fucking you can like squeeze and break it. That's it guys. Uh see you guys later. Right neck out.